Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov spoke on Wednesday about the immunity attempt as Seiji by the Warner Group over the weekend and didn't rule out the possibility that the United States might have played a role in these events. have been made that the United States is not interfering in Russia's internal affairs, not planning a regime change in Russia. It was said by the Strategic Communications Coordinator, Mr. Kirby, if I'm not mistaken, knowing the track record of the United States regarding regime change, such a statement sounds somewhat artificial. The top Russian diplomat also recalled that Washington openly financed opposition organizations in this country. Knowing how a few years ago American foundations and non-governmental organizations worked in our country, what they did, how they courted and trained the opposition in every possible way. There is no need to go into this topic in detail. This is an obvious slightness. The Russian Minister of Foreign Affairs declared a regular situation with the Wenger Group over and assured that the events did not represent any change in its country's strategy with the respect to the special operation in Ukraine. President Putin has already answered over the past few days. He has repeatedly made detailed assessment of the current situation, emphasizing that having overcome the attempted mutiny, we have not sacrificed targets for a special military operation at all and have not lost any positions on the battlefield.